Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new video. So a few days ago, I uploaded a video talking about Patrick, okay? Now, if you guys didn't watch the video, Patrick was a disabled kid in my Earth Science class who basically just jacked off in the middle of fucking class, just straight up. But a lot of people really enjoyed that story, so I thought I would tell another story of something that happened to me way before the whole Patrick thing, okay? Patrick, bless your soul. We all love you. But today, I'm gonna be telling the story of how I almost fucking killed a disabled kid. No joke whatsoever, I almost got a disabled kid fucking killed. So without further ado, let's just get straight into it. This is how little Calvin almost killed a disabled kid. Experience in HD. So the whole story starts off back in middle school, but my middle school, like a lot of other middle schools, had like a special ed tutor class in which you took the class, you show up, and you basically just have to babysit the handicapped kid. I feel like I'm gonna piss someone off with that, but that's pretty much what you do, dude. Yeah, when I was going to middle school, it was really popular, and a lot of people like to take that class. Now, honestly, I don't think it's because people wanted to help people and make the world a better place, but because a lot of people said it was an easy class, which was bullshit like first day i'm in there i'm like justin you want to do your homework come on buddy let's do the homework and he just looks at me and he's like no it's like okay justin are you sure you don't want to do your homework no what the fuck do i do now dude but yeah, man, 8th grade, I take that class, and in the beginning, I struggle with it, but I still keep it together, right? Until one day. And that day starts off with sunshine, birds chirping, flowers blooming, but I feel like shit. I feel like someone attacked me when I was sleeping. I'm aching all over the place, but I gotta get up and go to school. I pull myself out of bed. It hurts, man. It fucking hurts. I get to school, to my first period class special ed tutor. Now, I'm not really feeling up to it, but I still walk in, and I gotta talk to Justin. Yo, Justin, what's going on? Justin looks at me. He's the special ed kid. And he just makes this face like he's fucking disgusted of seeing me. Just looks at me and goes, ugh! Like, just, oh, what the fuck, Justin? Okay, I get it, you're special, but like, what the fuck was that, dude? But yeah, Justin looks at me like I'm the fucking cockroach of society, and he turns away, and I just sit down and we start to work on his homework. Now, I'm not gonna lie, okay? Justin was a fucking huge-ass hassle to get him to work, right? But today, it's extra hard. He's not listening to me. He just, he, dude, he's really mad about something. So I asked Justin, yo, dude, what, what's up, man? Like, are you mad about something? What's going on? And he looks at me and he says, I need to poop! And most of the time, you have to talk to the teacher to get permission of this, but man, I wasn't feeling up to it. I was feeling like shit. And on top of that, this is my first week into the class, so it's not like I'm like, you know, been there for a year or something. I'm still new to this as well, so I think, I don't think it's that big of a deal. And the teacher's not in the room right now, so I guess I'll take you to go take a shit or whatever. And also, FYI, I know someone's gonna comment this, but I don't actually help him take a shit. Like, I'm not pulling down his pants. I wouldn't do that for anybody. But I just wait outside the bathroom while he does his business business and yeah i decide why not so we get up we start to leave and spoiler alert this is when little calvin fucked up big time so i know everyone at this point in time is asking themselves well i mean like you know how is this gonna turn bad is he gonna fucking flush himself down the toilet how is he gonna die here huh what the fuck is this story calvin and don't you worry i'll tell you exactly what happens i open that door and fucking justin here bolts out that door like he's a nigerian prince dude he bolts out that door like it's a fucking prison break and i'm just sitting here stunned man i've never even seen this guy walk at a reasonable pace and now he's fucking running like Usain Bolt. What the fuck is this? So I sit there and I'm stunned, man. And he just runs for the exit and he doesn't stop at the exit. He fucking opens up that door and just keeps running. Like, that's it. He's fucking gone, dude. It's, it's over. Like, literally in the course of 10 seconds, he's already outside the school. Fucking... He's gone. I, I have no idea where he is. He fucking disappeared, dude. Holy shit. Like, honestly, my whole reaction to this was, what the fuck? And then he just... He's gone. He's fucking gone, okay? He's just... He's gone, dude. He's gone. And I'm just sitting there like, shit. But in the course of like 15 seconds, while well, he bolts out the door, and I sit there and try to regather my fucking thoughts, dude. But exactly when those 15 seconds end, the teacher comes back down the hallway, looks at me, looks at the open exit door, and just with the most serious face, says, 
Are you serious? So yeah, in this next two hours or so, me and the teacher go looking for him. We have to call on help from other teachers, and it's just a fucking mess and shit, right? But after two hours of searching, we find him across this huge-ass street. Like, like cars are going like 40 on that street. And apparently he ran across that street like he was fucking Sonic. And he was like laying on a curb or something, like he was dead. I'm not really sure. That's just what the teacher said to me. But I just got fucking chewed out for that. And I mean, it's, it's fucking well-deserved. That kid, quite honestly, should have been fucking dead like he ran across the street and apparently he was laying on curbs or something like next by cars that are driving 40 so i mean it's well deserved that i got fucking roasted for that and i mean yeah that was pretty much it that's the time i almost fucking killed a handicapped kid and i mean <laughs> shit i don't even know what to say i hope you guys enjoyed this video today and if you did it's your lucky day because for every person that likes the video they will be receiving for a limited time offer a free uh Free fucking Pokemon. Yep, free Pokemon. Limited time offer. No scam whatsoever. This is 100% legit. All you have to do is like the video, and it will it will be in your pocket right away. Yeah. Seriously, though, guys, thank you so much for all the support. You guys are just the fucking best. And, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this story, and peace, peace. Also, I need a boop!